Whoa! That's an orange horse. You're red. Oh, there's two. And there's two black horses. What's going on in here? I told you guys in a video a few weeks ago that I, there was a surprise coming and I haven't made a video since then. But, two more horses came to the farm. These are two Suffolk geldings. This is Virgil, and this is Woodrow. A little bit smaller than Queen and Samson. They've been here for almost two weeks now. We've had them out a few times. And they're really, really good horses. They're really good horses. on the roof, but this is Woodrow. No, this is Virgil. We took their halters off yesterday. I think they've had their halters on quite a while. <laughs> Might have had them on. You can see on their face. Definitely had them on for a little while. They're really happy here. They're, they like having free range and being able to go out on their own. We do a little we do it a little bit different here than I think where they were at before. Hi. Hey. Easy Queenie. Easy. When we first got him here we had him separated in this paddock here. And we had a, two fence lines like, I don't know, six feet apart. And then the first day we ended up putting them together and um they got along a little too well, especially Queen and Virgil. <laughs> so, it's a little exciting, it's pretty funny, but then we separated them for like a few days and then some one day Jay came home and they were together and they've been together since then, they've been doing really good together, so yeah. Hey Samson. Yeah, we still love you guys too. I think he's about 19 and he's 15. I'm not gonna go too much into detail right now. Um, when we got them, we weren't 100% sure if we were gonna keep them, so that's kind of why I didn't keep them, make a video. Um, they still might not stay too long, we're not sure. Um, I'm not gonna go too much into detail about it, but I might end up buying these from Jay. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. But anyways, this is Woodrow and Virgil. Actually, one day I came in here and I was walking the dogs and that gate got open. And that one was standing right in here. It didn't do too much damage. I backed him right out, but you can see this floorboard right here pushed down a little bit. I guess our floor's strong. Hi, Woodrow. Uh, these guys are so cute. I love the red. So good. These guys are shedding too. <laughs> they haven't done too much work in like six months, but we had them out the other day. We've had them out twice, and they are. They are nice in hand in driving. It's, I, they, they kind of, they kind of want us, I think they want us to keep them. That's why they're doing so good. They want to stay here. Got our harness wall. I had to move Applejack and Trevette stuff on one hook, but Queen, Samson, Woodrow, Virgil, and Applejack and Trevette. We have a lot of harness. We got all the collars, four harnesses over there. Gosh, there's a lot of tack in this barn. I took the, the runners off my my four cart because most of the snow has pretty much gone away now. I'm just gonna make this video pretty short. Just I just wanted to tell you guys we got some new horses. You'll be seeing them a little bit. But anyways, I got my buggy out the other day because I have somebody probably coming this weekend. And we're gonna go for a ride down the road with my horses. So I had to, it was over there in the corner, over there. So I had to pull the horse trailer out and get it out, but. I cleaned it up a little bit. I used the air hose to clean out the seats a little bit, and then I'm gonna take the bucket and um, kind of just clean it up a little bit, make it look a little nicer. Still have a ratchet strap holding up the top, but yeah, it adds some character, I guess. Hopefully you guys can hear me pretty good this whole video because it's raining in on the roof. It sounds pretty loud, but anyways, I'm just gonna go ahead and end the video here, and um, yeah, hope you guys excited as I am about the new horses. See you guys in the next one. Peace.